His children didn't know how their father made his living or why they so often moved. They didn't even know their father's name. He regretted neither his robberies nor the 17 murders that he laid claim to. And on September 5th, 1881, Jesse James was 34 years old. Can't believe I'm sitting with none other than Jesse James. Many's the night I stayed up, my eyes open, my mouth open, just reading about your escapades. They're all lies, you know. It is interesting the many ways you and I overlap. You're the youngest of three James boys, and I'm the youngest of five Ford boys. You have blue eyes, I have blue eyes. You're five feet eight inches tall, I'm five feet eight inches tall. I honestly believe I'm destined for great things, Mr. James. You're giving me signs that make me wonder. Maybe your mind's been changed about me. Can't figure it out. Do you want to be like me? Or you want to be me? You think it's all made up, don't you? You think it's all yarns and, and newspaper stories? He's just a human being. Red hands of a mean face. I wonder about that man that's gone so wrong. I've been nobody all my life. I know I won't get with this one opportunity, and you can bet your life I'm not going to spoil. Seems to me if you have something to confess, you spit it out now. <laughs> 